Hey guys, what's up Taurus? Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. It's going to be a reading for your immediate future. The situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. Um, to all of you who watch my channel, I appreciate it. I apologize for um, being MIA the past, shit, I guess it's been a week. It's like one damn thing after another. One of those weeks where whatever can hit you kind of hits you. Alright. So, I apologize. I'm back. Alright. Taurus, give me your future. Now, I'm going to create a post or something to let you guys know, but I think that's like public. I don't need everybody and woman know my business. <laughs> All right. So, Taurus, we need a future. Shit. All right, guys. So, keep in mind that the energies can go either way. So, this could be your energy or the energy of the person that you're dealing with. So, flip flop it how you need to. Also, keep in mind this is a general reading. So take what's yours, leave the rest behind. This does resonate with you today. Please make sure that you like and subscribe below. And if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, you find that information below as well. So if you're dealing with Cancer Scorpio Pisces, doesn't have to be. Just saw that King of Cups, so you definitely could. Um, it's all about emotions, right? Ooh, okay. So possibly you haven't been speaking to this person. With the Four of Swords and the Five of Pentacles, you may have felt like this person just forgot about you. Like they just left you behind. Or this could be them falling that way. All right, Taurus, media future. It's coming up for Taurus. Hmm. Could have been dealing with a Virgo or a Pisces. All right, let's see what's coming up. Ooh. Toxic situation. Capricorn energy. All right, a lot of stress. Things have kind of been at a crossroads with this situation. Definitely doesn't feel like it was equal give and take. All right, let's see. Immediate future for Taurus, please. The moon, the king of swords, and the judgment. So there could be things that were hidden here. Looks like communication if I were to leave these out. But, all right. So you could be dealing with the Pisces, or there could be things that are hidden from you right now. I kind of love when the moon card flips out, because, I mean, it can go either way. <laughs> it can be about secrets, it can be about, you know, some negative things, but it can also be about things that you're not seeing. So it's like, I don't know, intriguing. All right, so numbers are breaking down to a two. Choices, decisions, and we do have a decisions card here. So. Show me this moon. This is Pisces energy. Could be dealing with also Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, the Six of Swords. So somebody could be moving, traveling, or coming towards you, and you're just not seeing this right now. The world's there. So it's like a new cycle that's beginning, and you have the judgment. Yeah. Okay, so there definitely could be some communication that kind of comes in fast. And you may not even see this coming with the moon. This may be... Um, Still hidden from you. The Six of Swords can talk about traveling. It can talk about literally moving with the world here. This person could have been at a distance and someone is wanting to travel towards you here. Yeah, towards you, the Empress. All right. Possibly some communication, or it could even be someone literally coming to you that you're just not seeing right now. Show me this King of Swords. Oh, this person is stressed out. Definitely at a distance. Um, 
But the King of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, if not, he can kind of like, he's a logical thinker, right? He closes off his emotions. He can kind of come off as cold, um, very blunt. But being that he's a logical thinker, um, with the Nine of Swords, this is like a lot of stress this person is going through. They're like losing sleep, worrying about something. Um, Three of Swords at the bottom. So I don't know what they're so worried about. We'll try to find out. But the Four of Swords did pop out. So, you know, this could be around this uh, home. It could be around this connection. Hold this down. What are they so... What are they so stressed about? Show me this nine of swords. Why are they so stressed? Yeah, their strength could be a Leo, but they're definitely like trying to hold back their emotions about something here. So what is this four of wands? The devil. Hmm. Almost feels like someone lost control. But this could be an X with the devil there. Um, oh, damn. And the seven of swords. With the five of cups and the five of wands at the bottom. So somebody could... I don't know. Ugh. It's almost like an obsession here. The five of cups at the bottom. So there could also... You know, it's a general reading, but... Somebody could have be stressing like a choice that they made, a decision that they made, possibly something that they did. A whole lot of logical thinking around this person. And this is a general reading, so I'm not going to get too much into it. But this person is extremely um, stressed out. It's like they want to come towards you, but we have the Eight of Swords here too. So I'm not sure how this is going. This could be anything from spying. We had the Five of Swords there. I mean, the Five of Cups. So it could be regretting something they did. And now that they're really worried about it here. This could, you know, could go a couple of ways. Mm. Okay, all right, let's see this judgment. They're definitely holding back their emotions. Because there's a lot, there's emotions there, but the, this person's not letting you see that. But they're incredibly stressed around something. Possibly something that, you know, happened or something like that. Show me this judgment. One card, please. Thank you. All right. The six of Wands. It's a card of victory. A card of success. See which way this is going. All right. So, yeah, they're coming towards you. They want success with the judgment card here. It could be a reconciliation. Um, it could be. It's also like a time to um, work on past issues. You could also have, you know, some success at work here. And now this person is watching you and doesn't know what to do. Because I think they kind of, it's like they, with the judgment here, they kind of, it's a decision, right? It's an opportunity to try to work on things, to try to rebuild. It could be, um... A reconciliation as well yeah there's a new opportunity here to work on something there's success there's victory around it and it looks like it moves forward quite quickly yeah the full you're taking a leap of faith towards this opportunity whatever this is uh, it could be work or love related because you definitely have someone um, could be a cancer, but yeah, definitely travel, definitely moving towards this, whether it's work or love, because you definitely have a person here who's like stressing the hell out of you or not stress, stressing over you. Sorry. They're not speaking up with their emotions.
and it definitely could have been, you know, I mean, it could be anything from spying to, you know, maybe this person has something, they're watching you kind of be successful here, so they're worried about that, or there could have been, you know, some regret for a past action, it's a general reading, the Six of Cups, this is coming back around, someone is like, yeah, the Two of Wands, moving forward, um, a lot of freaking stress. I don't know what they're so stressed about. It'd be different for everybody. They're coming straight towards you. So this could be victory with work. This could be victory with a love situation. Or this could be you stressing your job as well. But either way. Um, the Nine of Pentacles and the Nine of Cups. Wish fulfillment here. A lot of happiness. A lot of knowing your self-worth. You know, you've got your shit together with that. All right, Taurus. So there's a new opportunity here for you. And you're, you're standing in your power as the Empress here. You're successful and you're going towards it pretty quickly here. But this person, if this somebody kind of coming back around, they're very stressed about something. We have Cancer, Taurus, Energy, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Pisces. I mean, it could be, we have everything here. So this person is incredibly stressed, though. The feeling that comes off that. So the opportunity is here for you. And it looks like you're going for it. There is victory around it. You're moving forward. You're happy. It looks like it moves pretty quick once it starts moving. All right, so I hope this helps. Hope this resonates for you. So please make sure that you like and subscribe below. You guys take care and I'll see you next time. Bye.